Hey, what's up YouTube? I'm excited to be back. So in the interest of time, I had to break up the Freedom Breeder Tour into three episodes. So stay tuned for part two. Cue the music and let's jump on in. If you saw my latest um, like Instagram post, but these are all the snakes I got from uh, Will Banks. Yeah, yeah, I did. So yeah. I like this as a head. Really nice head, clown. So I bought these are all males. That's nice. On the cocoa blocks, ready to smack down some rats. Oh yeah. <laughs> I like these these tubs too. Yeah. Yeah, these are. I I want I want to do all gray. I really don't like semi clear at all. Yeah. But is it, look how I mean, look how many tubs I'm gonna have to throw away. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's a lot, man. Uh, I, I don't like selling anything really used or nothing. Oh, that's sweet. Hit for clown. Yeah, that's real sweet. Looks nice in person. Oh yeah. Oh, I haven't posted part two. That's no, why yeah. you haven't seen these yet. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You're well, seeing them before, just don't post this up before nah, I do. Nah, nah. <laughs> but yeah, this thing's insane. Oh, yeah, that's was, sweet. When I seen this, I was like, I'm buying them, buying them all. So this would be a yellow belly calico or sugar uh, head clown. Sweet. It's nice, man. Like the marbling right there? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So there's those. I got some, I got some other ones, but uh, there's another one that has like a different like type of lower uh, white. Well, yeah, lower expression or whatever you call yeah, it. Yeah, lower expression, but it's still really nice. So that's a calico, yellow belly, or yeah. sh sugar. His line is sugar, I guess. So, But you see that they vary, you know what I mean? Some people would say, oh, this is calico, the other one's sugar. Yeah. But they vary. So this is probably from the same clutch, considering how the size they are, but they might not be. I don't know. I didn't ask him. Yeah, I would have assumed the same clutch, but you never know. Yeah, exactly. He puts out mass snakes, doesn't he? Wilbanks? Yeah, he is. Badass stuff too. Look at the firefly. Come on, you see that chunk though. That's real nice. <laughs> oh yeah. How white the head is. That's oh nice. yeah. That's why I had. Uh, I was like, I need a, I need a firefly clown. In my life. Oh yeah. Can't go wrong with firefly clown. No. <laughs> no, not at all. That one, that one's real nice. We got this inchy clown was really nice. I wanted that. It's a male. Oh, real clean. Yeah, because I have another entry clown that's like more browned out, not crazy, not as crazy as this in the head. Yeah. Oh, it's tripping out right now. But this right. one's super nice. Real clean. Yeah. Regular fire clown. Dude, that's phenomenal. That one. Oh yeah, these ones are all like probably a Maybe a month or two, maybe two months from breeding, probably. So this is just the fire sugar yellow belly clown. That's nice. The sides that? right there? Yeah, that's incredible. Real nice. Nice head stamp. Super nice. Oh yeah. And then I like this one too, a lot. So I think this one's gonna be pretty nice when I put it to like some black pastel stuff or even with inchy, inchy yellow belly stuff's real nice with calico or sugar. Yeah. I got the belly, the way it's like checkered. Mm-hmm. Sweet. Or even some cryptic at clown stuff I have. And so I don't know if you see like cryptic in that, but this is a head. So I bred something like this to another snake that looked like this popped out cryptics yeah exactly yeah that, that would mean recessive to me too yeah so if they look like that straight up normals yeah then what's a super cryptic look like yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so yeah. is anybody can show, can they show me that exactly nah they can't exactly so if, if that's if that's a regular cryptic then the project's dead <laughs> yeah in my opinion yeah, yeah. but if this is if this is a hit cryptic so it's a normal, and then you're gonna get something that looks. Let me see if I can find one in here. I'm sure I have one. Oh, right. this one's on the website. Oh, yeah. 
That's clean, man. There's no shit in there. Nice. So if those, if, if that was a single gene, this would be the super? Yeah, I don't think so. There's no characteristics that even look similar to no. it or anything. Oh. Sorry. Goodbye, man. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Side by side comparison there. So that's Het versus the visual cryptic. Night and day. Well, there's a lot of cool stuff, man. Like, you can just check out, open some trays. I mean, oh, yeah. see what you like. I have a lot of personal favorites and stuff, but. Oh, man. Black pastel mojave. That's fucking sick right there. What is that one? Black pastel, Mojave, possible cypress. Yeah. Possible oh, cypress. Cypress to me, man. Yeah, but some black passes on my hobbies do that striping stuff, so it's kind of like, yeah, hard to say. It's definitely something I'm keeping, and that's why it's still here. All right. Oh, here's another one. Let's see, oh, that's clean as fuck. Okay, maybe maybe that one does look like it has cypress. This one. I think yeah, it's more pixelated, don't you think? Yeah, that one I'd say is cypress for sure, and then this one was a pause as well. Yeah, so I just saw that one. <laughs> I like blackhead stuff too. Yeah, real dark. Yeah. So I'm gonna have to get some snakes for me next time I come up too. I really but... like these. When I produced these, I was like, oh my gosh, this is what I'm doing with all my bongo. Oh wow. That's badass. Yeah, so that's, that's like... a coral glow bongo black pastel. Yeah, that's just like purple. Female maker. I'm like a baby, baby paradox. Sick. Oh yeah. That's real nice. I don't even know if the camera's gonna pick that up. The color. Let's see if we get like a little right there. Yeah. That's real nice. Oh, the Raven. That's what you got that I like too. Oh yeah, I had sold one of those uh, recently. Um, the one I had on the website. That they were super happy. It was super dark too. It was a really nice expression one. Yeah. I think they got the male. Random Raven. Oh no, they got a Mojave Raven. Raven's nice. Yeah, there's so many jeans out there, it's like, shit. I mean, like, you need a facility like you got to have everything, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. exactly. We have a lot of different stuff, but... Uh, I'm working out in my garage, so I'm like, fuck, man. How much can I really hold in here, you know? <laughs> <laughs> You had a lot of space, I seen it. You yeah. Had a lot of space over there. Hey, what is that? That's nice. Coral Glow Pewter Special Leopard. That's power. Yeah. Powerhouse. I'm definitely keeping that. It's a weird gene in them. I have. It's like you're not your average uh, super coral glow. I don't think That's I clean any. though. Yeah. So let me see if I have. So this is it right here. So it has like this weird. Like a pattern to it. Yeah. And then if you look at this, it has the same thing going on in it right here with these little circles inside of it. Yeah. Let me show you what a regular coral glow would look like. There's a royal coral glow. That actually looks like a royal for sure. So it has all these. Like I showed you that that one has something like this, but it's not the same. This is this is a arroyo. It definitely looks. Has its own unique look to it. Put it on the chunk. On the chunk. I like <laughs> that. Um, pastel. This, was, this is the other new gene I'm working with. This is what pastel mixed in. I mentioned it in one of my videos, but I haven't showed the pastel yet. So this is the pastel black bag um, coral glow. So yeah. it's been really consistently throwing off these ones with these uh, black striping down its back, but obviously you don't see it because it's a pastel and coral glow. Yeah. But you can see that it's, uh, well, it's showing definitely up dark. genetically. Yeah, it's definitely darker there. Yeah, so if we had... Oh, that's sick. So it's pr producing snakes like this constantly. So it's a gene, I just gotta... Yeah. I wanna see what the super hit's like. Once the super hit's like, it's gonna be... I know for a fact it's gonna be crazy. Yeah, I like that dark version. Yeah, so if you see the single gene with no coral glow, it's just like that. Oh, yeah. 
So that's a single gene. So this is single gene right here. What are you calling it? Black bag. That's how black I bag? labeled it, but I don't have I haven't made a name for it yet. Yeah. But I mean it's a black bag. I mean look. I mean it's not really I don't know how to I don't know how to explain it, but oh, I'm just gonna grab himself. Um, so you can see that the gene is there, and yeah. then the coral glow, and then the pastel coral glow. I mean, now I just gotta I have females of this right here, since coral glows are males and the um, females are not coral glows. So that's how I got the females. I got females. I got a few of them. So I should be doing that pairing soon. I want to try to show you like sentinel and paint. Yeah. The single gene. There's yeah. a lot of there's a lot of talk about it. Yeah, there's a lot of I talk can about see that it. too. So, it, like, if you look at this, it's getting some neck striping, and you get like this granite look inside. Yeah. So when you get the super paint, it's like extreme granite in the middle, and then striping down the back. So like the single gene, you can even see it. Um, so in your opinion, is it? It's codon because it's codon. I see it in a single gene, right. and you don't have like a straight, straight normal with no granite pattern or you, you don't see a paint or a sentinel that has like no pattern at all. Like you're gonna see the you'll see it. the graniting and all that stuff. Yeah. And you'll get a little bit of the neck striping and whatnot. And it also has more of an orangish orange ish hue to it when uh it's single gene as well or if you mix it with like pastel or enchi or something. Let me see if I have some of those. So my my opinion it's coat off. That. So that red exanthic yellow belly coral glue down there, that's the full on red exanthic? Right right there. This one? Yeah. Yeah. That's nice. Real nice. We got a lot of stuff. Oh yeah. We got a lot of heat in here, man. Oh yeah, man. You keep it warm in here. <laughs> That's what my lady likes is bamboos and, and bamboo coral glows. Like right up her alley right there. Like purples and everything. Mm -hmm. I'd much rather have one of these than like say like a Mojave coral glow or something like that. I really yeah, exactly. like this. That takes out the freckles too, right? Oh, it seems like you see it, like one, one, but yeah, majority, yeah. Yeah, because I have a Mojave coral. Uh, Let's see, we have another one. That, I mean, it's got real, a couple freckles, but for the most part, it took them out. Let's see what another one looks like, see if it has some. This is pastel mixed in with it. The other one has possible pastel, but now that as they age, you see the yellow a lot more. So yeah, it does kind of take out most of the freckles. Yeah. Never really looked at it all that hard. Because nice. I wasn't selling it. Look how bright that head is, huh? It's pretty nice. Oh yeah. I like it. Pastel does, look, pastel with Coral Glow is crazy. Like, especially as they get older, it's even crazier. It really compliments the Coral Glow. So boy, this this was the gargoyle, black pastel, Mojave, Enchi, coral glow. That's sick. That's sick. Look at that stripe from the head. Nice. Yeah, it's about to go on the move right now. All right, so as you can see, Jesse's packing a lot of heat in there. Man, he's got a phenomenal collection. And uh, next week, we'll go into the Cocoa Block Shaker build and see how it works and everything. We'll bust open some Cocoa Blocks and uh, shake it out and do the whole nine yards. So until next time, rock on. Now some high quality H2O. Don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe, and hit the notification bell, and we'll see you guys next time.